Hi guys, so I know you might have just saw me like this because I might upload another video looking the same way, but talking about something else. <laughs> All right, so honestly, this is going to be a great haul because I almost thoroughly enjoyed every single piece, okay? So yeah, this is a pretty successful haul and it's featuring Curvy Scents. Now, I never ever even heard of Curvy Scents, so they contacted me to do a review for their company and I'm like... I click on a site and I'm like, whoa, they have some really cool clothes. Like, why haven't I heard of you guys? And I love the way the website is set up. It's really clean cut and straight to the point. And I really like that about it. I don't like, I don't want to throw shade at any companies, but when everything's just all over the place and it's not, it's just, it's too much going on on the website to the point where you don't even want to be bothered with it. But this site, I really like it. So let's go ahead and get started. I have eight pieces that I want to show you and I'm going to start off with this top so this is a size 2x of course i'm going to leave the sizes and all that good stuff on the screen and this is really just a a crop top and it's in a like i said a 2x and i was super surprised by the way it fit because it fits so perfectly and yes i am a 2x up top most of the time and a 3x on the bottom but um i don't know i just really like the way this fit is it comes down to a nice length it's um it's pretty thin like I can see the camera through here but for the most part when I put it on you couldn't see anything through it and I like the way that the V is it comes to a a modest V like it's not showing all your cleavage but it is giving you a little bit of sex appeal so I really like that and I like the color and it's just like that slouchy piece that you know it's just really casual I'll probably put on some Jordans with it like, for instance, these Jordans right here. Throw on some jeans and maybe a bomber and call it a day. So, that's the first piece. Again, prices and all that good stuff will be on the screen. And the next piece is... I'm just picking them up randomly, by the way. This bodycon right here. Now, it has that oval bottom with the little slits at it at the end but i really thought this one was really modest because when you see these dresses they're usually super short and then a lot of your leg is exposed but i like the fact that this one came down a little bit further it has like hints of gray in it i believe that's gray and it's just really cute it's a nice material it's ribbed and it has this type of neckline peephole in the front and in the back i just like the little details and it is a great quality and it stretches a lot so um, definitely a keeper I think I got this in a 3x I think so yeah but I could have got a 2x but I really like the 3x on me next thing is also a dress and this is piece number three I feel like I misplaced the piece <laughs> I, I only see seven over here now this is just a simple little dress and I was like let me pick that up because and it also has that it's like a heather gray in there like just mixed in with this nudish tannish color and I think that's really cute the beige and gray mixture and it's just really well made I like the way that the things are made and the back has this line across the top of the neck and then it goes down really low but it didn't go down too far to the point where you can't wear a bra and I really like that about it so yeah it cinches in a little bit at the waist and then it just flares out a little bit uh gives you that effortless look and i will wear this on a casual day probably with some tan um sandals and a tan purse and that's it like don't have to overdo it so the fourth piece i want to talk about oh here we go i didn't want to get into the other stuff first is this bodysuit and y'all this trend with the choker neck is definitely major right now uh and then it zips and the zipper is functional and it's gold and it's a rib material it's black and blue mixed together or it might even be navy and this uh, lighter blue mixed together and then it snaps at the bottom I like that the snaps are sturdy like they actually stay snapped I like that about it the only thing is it's not a thong so you can see the line even when I had on, I tried on the jeans with this, you saw the line of the bodysuit with the jeans or in the jeans. So, 
But I did want to say about the choker part. A lot of people complain when the chokers don't have the snap at the back. This one doesn't, but it stretches a lot. It went over my wig and did not alter the where the wig was at. I had on the afro one. So, I really didn't have a problem with this choker not having the snaps. And I was able to put it on without unsnapping the bottom. I hate unsnapping the bottom because it's like a hassle to snap it back. So, um, I was really pleased with this and I'm super excited about this bodysuit. And I can't wait to style it and layer it under a duster with some high waist jeans and probably over the knee boots or even some heels. So, yep. The next thing um, I'll talk about are the jeans. And this one is actually a darker wash. This is more of a denim feel than the other pair so the jeans went up and all that good stuff it buttoned it zipped but with these i would definitely need a belt to keep them up and keep my crack from showing because we don't want that <laughs> um i have a slight little detailing right here where it's like lighter lines what i really do like about the jeans is this back part it has like a little v which actually makes your butt look really good. Like the stitching right here. I like that about it. I like that it has five pockets and all of them are functional. I can't stand when people call stuff jeans and they don't have front pockets. Although I might not use front pockets. I just like to have them. Like I really do. However, um, they aren't, I guess, the best jeans for me. Like they came down to my ankle and stuff. They were a decent length. They weren't super tight at the ankle and I don't know what shoe I would wear with these. Like these would probably be like my casual jeans that I wear with some sneakers or something or some Timberland boots. But I do like them. They do come up. They do look nice. I just feel like maybe if they were a little bit more high waisted I would really love them. But they come to like an awkward place on me. So yeah. The next pair of jeans is a different material. It has like a a softer feel to it I really do like these I don't know something is really aggravating me on my face it's making me itch <laughs> I really do like these but again they come to an awkward place I would like that they were a little bit more high-waisted but they do have five functional pockets and I like that about it on the back the detail doesn't go into a V like the other ones but it does go straight across and it still makes your butt look nice I got both of these, I think, in a 22, if I'm not mistaken. I wouldn't size up because I think they would be too big. And then I definitely wouldn't size down because they probably wouldn't come on. So I think this 22 was a perfect fit. I really like the fact that these are really soft. And they fit almost just like the other pair. The other pair were probably just a bit more snug. The next thing is this denim jacket. And... I was sent a denim jacket from another company, but it didn't fit. It was like too tight in the arms. I like the fact that this jacket has the denim look, but it has like crazy stretch, like crazy stretch. So if you have bigger arms, you're definitely probably going to be able to get into this, which I really like because it's not that super stiff, just denim material. So I like that. Um, It has the pocket right here and right here. It has the little details that all jean jackets are supposed to have. You know, the little buckles at the side and stuff. It's a little bit cropped. Like, it comes a little high. I think maybe to the top of my jeans when I uh, tried it on. And um, it closes and buttons and no buckles and stuff like that. Like, when I say buckle, like, you know when you button something but you can still see, like, your shirt or your bra through it. That's what I mean. Like, this actually stays closed. And again, it stretches around your midriff. The whole material of the jacket is stretchy. This was probably my most favorite piece out of the whole entire haul. And it's this super long bomber jacket. And it comes past my butt. And it just comes to a great length. The It doesn't stretch though. So I think I got this in a 3X if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, I got it in a 3X and my arms are pretty big and they weren't uncomfortable in here. But I will tell you, if your arms are probably a little bit bigger than mine, it might not fit because it was snug and it doesn't stretch. But it just have patches like over here. You see an eye 
um, a smiley face, uh, some french fries. Funny thing is, I don't really like french fries. Like, I really have to be in a mood for them. Or they have to be on a sandwich for me to eat them. Um, a butterfly. It says, I believe in angel. And this one just says, champion. It's 98. It has pockets on both sides, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it zips up. But then it has like a little space between the zipper and the bottom. So it keeps like that part open. And then it has a drawstring at the bottom which you can use to tighten it. And if I can find the other one. Okay. So it does have drawstrings. I don't know. This coat was just really different. Really unique. And I really liked it. And of course like most bombers it doesn't have a hoodie. But that's not a problem with me. And yeah, I really like this piece. Like I said, it was my favorite out of the whole thing. I was really looking for a bomber this color green. And this is the one. This is the day right here. I really like it. So, thank you again, Curvy Sims, for working with me. Thank you again, viewers. Thank you guys so much for watching and rocking with me throughout this haul. We're 11 minutes in. And I just like, like I said, to get the details in. So, that's why my haul seemed to be a little bit longer, even for just eight pieces. I still like to give you guys all the details and I hope you appreciate it. If not, you know, let me know. Like, Kwana, calm down a little bit. Shorten the times on your videos. <laughs> but anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll definitely leave all the links and all that good stuff below. That was cute, right? <laughs>